It's your girl Jasmine K Jazzy J and I'm back with another video. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. First and foremost, y'all, I know y'all see me with this new thing going on my hair. So I actually cut it and you know, it's still wet so it's a little thin. I think I like it better when it dries, but I actually did this before. Let me insert the video right here. This is what I'm trying to look like and this is what I look like, okay? So whatever, I'm still popping, still popping. I'll wait. But today, y'all, I'm going to be doing a Mother's Day gift guide because Mother's Day is next weekend. And I know y'all haven't got y'all mama nothing for Mother's Day yet. So I'm going to give y'all a little guide on what to get your mama for Mother's Day. I got 30 things that I'm just going to kind of go rapid fire, kind of go rapid fire because some things need some explanation. Why does it look like the camera keeps going out of focus? I don't know if it's my eyes or the camera. However, I have 30 things that you can get your mama for Mother's Day. Some of these things are kind of expensive, some are not, but you can really make a lot of them not expensive. I got this list of stuff. I'm gonna just go over it and explain it so that you know what to get your mama for Mother's Day so you better not show up to your mama house on Mother's Day without nothing. Before we get into this video, don't forget to smash the like button, comment down below, or subscribe, turn on post notifications so you don't miss a video because you don't want to miss this. And let's get into this video. So the first thing you can get your mom for Mother's Day is a purse, Michael Kors, Coach is my mama's favorite, Kate Spade, you know, Louis Vuitton, whatever. Whoever purse you want to get, or if you want to get a cheap little purse, it don't matter. You don't have to spend a whole bunch of buku money because if they're anything like my mama, simple is fine. Even though I just said Coach is her favorite, ignore that. You can get her a wallet. You can get her a necklace. There's a lot of necklaces on sale right now that have like, oh, mom or mother or something, some type of something, cute pendant little thing on a necklace so you can get that. You could get her a charm bracelet from Pandora. I actually have a prom, uh, I actually have a charm bracelet and I have the little pendant and it says mom on it. I'm pretty sure they have those now, but I lost my charm bracelet right now, y'all. So I'm in the process of trying to find that and I'm gonna be really upset if I have to replace it because there's a lot of charms on there and it's very expensive, not gonna lie to you. So that's my story. You could get your mama some roses or some other flowers. You know, roses are my favorite. So I always just say roses, you know, whatever, whatever. I would say since it's more springtime, you could go with like carnations or tulips or any of them. I don't really know my flowers too much, but I know what the carnations look like and I know what the tulips look like. I don't know what the other flowers look like or what they call it. So yeah, you can get some of those. You could get her a skincare kit if she's into, you know, that type of thing. Cause most people are nowadays, but you know, if your mama is on the older side like mine, she is not as into it, you know. She just washes her face and puts on some Jergens lotion. <laughs> you could get her some perfume. Everybody likes to smell good, so you can definitely get your mama some perfume. You can get her a, some lotion or a lotion set. Um, a good place to go for some lotion for your mom is Victoria's Secret. My mama loves Love Spell. Love Spell lotion and perfume is like what she swears by. And Amber Romance too. Y'all, Amber Romance is mine. That's that's some good quality, I'm not gonna lie, that's good right there. You could get your mama some shoes, like some whatever, Crocs, whoever. You know, it don't have to be expensive, it don't have to be crazy outrageous, unless you want to, you know, get your mama some Balenciagas. You, if your mama is like a cooker, you know, you know, like if your mama be in the kitchen, like cooking, you could get her a small appliance, like an air fryer, a coffee maker, anything like that because those coffee makers, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, the coffee makers they target me on sale all the time and they probably on sale even more now. If your mama likes to read, you could get her a book or some books. You could get your mom an iPad, which is very good for my mom. And you know, the older generation who's not really into all the electronics and stuff ipads are really easy to use and really simple and big so they can see that and do whatever they want to do on it you can get your mama a pajama set you can get her some bath bombs you know everybody likes a good bath bubble bath you know bubble bath you can get your mom a heated or weighted blanket oh it's cozy everybody likes to be cozy and i know your mom does too you can get specialty chocolate you know y'all like the uppity chocolate not like hershey's twix you know those like the uppity up chocolate. You could get your mama a bottle of wine. She's over 21, so you could get your mama a bottle of wine. 
get your mama a bottle of wine. She likes to relax and chill by herself. Oh, I actually have something to recommend for y'all. This wine right here, as you can see, it's almost gone. This is the bomb. It makes me feel like a bad chick every single, every single time I drink it. Real bad, real uppity, real classy. This wine right here, Stella Rosa Stella Berry, is amazing. It's so good, y'all. It's sweet. It has just a good wine taste. You just feel so classy. So if you need a wine to get your mama, I would recommend Stella Rosa, um, Stella Berry, or Stella Rosso. That one's good, too. It's like a red wine if, she, if you don't like the white. You could get your mama a foot spa, you know, the things that they put their feet in and stuff. You know, they got them at Walmart. You could get your mom an edible arrangement. I know those can be pretty pricey. I'm not going to lie because I wanted to get one for myself. But I was like, ooh, those prices, not getting that. But you could get that for your mom for Mother's Day. You could get her any, you know, gift cards or whatever. If you really have absolutely zero idea and clue what she wants or what to get her. And you don't know anything else on this list, you can get her a gift card. You could do a DIY gift basket with all of her favorite snacks or when I actually had to get I had an idea for like a cookie mom or something you can get like a pot like one of those big pots and you can get all types of like if your mom's into healthy um foods and stuff you can get healthy food snacks or whatever put them in there you get all of her favorite snacks whatever she likes and put them in there and stuff and it's like a gift basket that's real cute ain't it that was a good idea good idea that's you could get your mama some candles. Everybody loves candles and smell goods. Well, everybody don't love candles because my mama don't like candles. But, you know, candles or wax warmer or something like that. They, everybody like their house to smell good. And if you don't, you have a problem. You can get your mama some house shoes so she can be comfortable walking around the house. You know, some cute little slippers. I get mine from Target. There's a bomb.com. About $15. Great. You can get your mom a personalized picture frame. You know, maybe you and your siblings can have your names written around the picture frame and have like a picture of y'all in it. That would be real cute. You can get your mom an Apple Watch or a Fitbit. I know this is more on the high end side as well, but you know, nowadays everybody wants something tracking their steps or something. So if your mom's into gardening, you can get her like a, uh, some type of gardening kit or anything for her little garden or whatever, you know, she wants to do. Or if your mom has been talking about she wants to get into gardening, you can do that. You can get your mom some sunglasses even. I mean, like it's about to be summertime. My mama buys like five pairs of sunglasses each summer. Like she buys probably like two at the beginning of summer another one in the middle because she lost the other two and then she buys some more at the end it's just crazy honey it, it's just crazy you could get your mom some fuzzy socks i know this is kind of like a christmas thing but you know everybody likes to be comfy like i said if you really don't know you know maybe your mama wants some fuzzy socks you could get your mom like a massager you know they have like those one massage like gun things that you could y'all when i was pregnant i used and it was great it was amazing the last and final thing is a bit much but you could get your mom a pet you get her a dog or a cat i would suggest a dog okay y'all so i was saying before my camera very disrespectfully died i recommend getting your mama a dog unless your mom has expressed that she likes cats and you know kittens and things like that i would suggest a dog i personally have a phobia of cats like no, I don't want nobody to be offended. Nobody take offense to this. This is just me and my thinking and the way that I see the world, okay? Cats make my skin crawl. Like, it's a phobia for real. Like, I'm not scared like, oh my God, I'm scared. Like, I'm, I'm actually scared of dogs. Like, I'm actually scared of dogs, but I think dogs are so cute. Like, I love looking at them and stuff. Actually, some dogs I'm not scared of. It's actually very weird because I like our pet dogs. Like, if y'all saw my vlog, from Christmas or whatever, like I pet this dog in the fashion mall. I pet all types of dogs. However, some dogs scare me. But cats, I can't get with no type of cat. I don't even I don't even care if it's the cleanest cat on earth. I cannot get with it. Y'all, I have a phobia. It, I'm not scared of it. It just, it makes me ugh, ugh. Like, I don't know, it just, oh God, y'all. It makes my skin crawl. Almost like when you see a bug or something or you feel like bugs crawl on you. Not that cats are dirty or anything but i don't know and they're just so sneaky and just so oh my god i can't even talk about cats i can't even do it i can't even do it that's how much strong how strongly i feel oh god i can't no offense to you if you like cats because that's your thing but i'm just saying that i have a phobia oh i can't i can't <laughs> All right, you guys, that is the end of this video. I hope you found something to get for your mom for Mother's Day so you don't show up to her house empty-handed. Shower her with love and tell her that you love her because everybody loves their mommies. If you know anybody who's a mom, shout them out. Happy Mother's Day. It's gonna be my first 
technical Mother's Day. I was pregnant last Mother's Day, so. All right, you guys, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to smash the like button, comment down below, subscribe, turn on post notifications so you don't miss a video because you don't wanna miss this. And I'll see you guys in the next video.